1.4 million Americans are affected by this next condition we are going to be talking about. Welcome back to Get Connected. I'm your host, Con Jackson. We've got a rising star. He has gone on some of the biggest stages in the world, including American Idols. But he had a medical condition that kept him back, but not until he found the answers. And he's going to share those with us right now. Casey Abrams joins us live. Welcome, Casey. It is great to be with you, Con. Well, Casey, I love your energy. We know where you are now, but take us back one year ago. What were you up to? I was on my uh, I was on my couch. I was eating cereal. I was watching Seinfeld. I was dreaming of doing this. Well, no doubt about it, Casey. Your day has finally arrived. Well deserved. But with all the seasons of American Idol, what got you to finally audition? To be honest, I since the very first season, I was like. I can do that and you know I never really tried out and uh, then I remember uh, I got actually sick with with ulcerative colitis and uh, I had to stop school so I went home watched a couple episodes and I got hooked and I was like you know what I'm gonna study and I'm gonna I'm gonna do the next season we'll see what happens all right Casey let's talk about your diagnosis what led you to go see a doctor uh, I was going to the bathroom way too many times a day and uh, I was getting stomach cramps I was uh, carrying my base on my back across campus. I put my base down as soon as I got to class, and I just passed out. And I could, I, it was really hard to, to even play, you know. I, sometimes I just, just sit down and just watch because I was just having trouble breathing. And Casey, what was your reaction to the diagnosis when you heard you had the ultra colitis? Ultrative colitis. Ultra, ultra what, man? <laughs> yeah. It's a... Uh, it's it's yeah I have I had no I didn't even know what those words meant I was like I heard ulcer in there and colitis I had no idea <clears throat> but yeah it's it's IBD it's an inflammatory bowel disease it's a chronic digestive disease and it, it it affects my colon so it's 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 pretty it's pretty embarrassing to talk about and so that's why I think we need to do this awareness campaign. Well, Casey, tell us more about the campaign. Mm -hmm. Well, we have this website, me and Jansen Biotech have teamed up to do IBDicons.com and uh, I have a pretty interesting story. I was on TV and I had all sort of colitis, but there's way more inspiring stories out there of people living daily life with the, the disease and them getting past their, their complications to just live an, a normal life. You know, so they've sent in the, uh, their stories to IBDicons.com where people can now vote on the most inspiring and we have a uh, top finalists and uh, so every time someone goes to the website and votes on one of their favorite finalists the uh, dollar is donated to the CCFA which is Crohn's and Colitis Foundation of America so it's 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 good it's for research and education about the disease well one thing you know for sure Casey is how it feels to be voted on what is that like <laughs> Getting voted on, I to be honest, I can't believe I made it as far as, as I did. I think it's um, it's weird that you have people who who like you that's that that honor your 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 respected art form. So that was pretty crazy. All right, when you were on the stage by yourself, an American Idol, what was it like? That was a uh, that was an experience. Um, I remember that performance actually. I just got out of the hospital. And uh, I performed, and then right after that performance, I went straight back to the hospital. <laughs> and, uh, and it, yeah, it was pretty crazy. It was, uh, but you know what I liked about that performance was the fact that I didn't practice it, and it was very spontaneous, and I think that's, that's where I, I get my happiness from. I have, I have ADD, so when I, when I practice a song a certain way over and over again, it gets boring. So, so that was fun, you know. Well, Casey, it's been awesome having you. Given the challenges that you face, the success you've had, what advice would you give to any of us living out our dreams? Um, if something's wrong, don't try to be Superman like me. I, you know, don't try to just, I'm fine, I'm not sick, and then I'm in the hospital the next day. Really, just try to seek help, see a doctor, uh, you know, and uh, for singing, confidence. Have some confidence when you're singing. Get up there and uh, sing your butt off. One thing's for certain, Casey. Thanks for your passion, your advice, and time today. Cool. Thanks a lot, man. You can check out other Health Beat segments. We all want to live better so we can live longer and happier. We'll be right back on Get Connected. Thank you so much for watching. Are you tired of negative news? We are. And that's why we're creating a movement. 
by keeping it real. With what you need to know. It's more than what's happening. It's bringing hope back to our lives. So go to ConTV.com and join our movement.